it's one that I think that we can all go away from here and try and argue about no matter what our perspectives are, what our positions are about the nature of the EU or anything else. What unites everyone who's in this crowd is an unrelenting uh, defense of migration and an unrelenting opposition to, uh, to racism. And I think that there's a real issue that we face in the outcome of the election today, which is that a lot of people, a lot of my friends, a lot of my dearest friends are worried about what is going to happen to them. They've come from overseas, they've come from Europe. And I think that from out of this demonstration, we can have a concrete demand, and that's one that goes beyond an argument about open borders, although I think that we need to keep an argument about open borders. It goes beyond an argument that talks about a long-term thing, but an immediate thing, and that is that we need to raise an argument in the labor movement, in our trade union branches, in our campaigns, in, in, in our, if we're in the Labour Party, in the Labour Party branches we're in, which is that we need an immediate guarantee of the rights of all migrants who are living in Britain that they will not be sent away, that they will not lose their right to stay in Britain, that they will not lose their right to work in Britain. And I think that that's something that we can test. Who knows what we'll win? Who knows what we can win? But we know, for example, that that's something that Jeremy Corbyn believes in. We know that that's something that all kinds of people in the Labour movement believe in. And I think that out of this, we need to go out and say that we are not going to put up with any attacks or any infringements on the rights of our friends, of our lovers, or of ourselves, because there are so many migrants here today. And I think that that is something concrete that we can take out of this demo and take out into the movements, into the campaigns that we're involved in.